Uh, my friends, welcome back to Stellaris uh, version 2.3, actually 2.3.1 because I decided to opt in uh, with all the beta releases automatically. So sometimes we'll have um, a few changes going on. Uh, by the time this video gets out, it might already been released, I don't know. So we got this archaeological site that we are going to look into. Our construction ship is going to get the uh, the energy and minerals out of here, and then moving on to the VMAS system and take all of this under control. Um, as for our um, military, I I think it's going to be a um, a good time to make sure that we got everything that we want. So. Let's make sure they upgrade, then we'll move into these two systems, get rid of the alien entities who are currently occupying that portion of space. And oh wow, you guys have been growing nicely. Oh, you're part of the, uh, the Righteous Entity Federation. There are a lot, a lot of members. That could actually be very, uh, be very interesting, a war with them. They're unfriendly, they... They got a good amount of population going. I got 740. Yeah, looking very much forward to this. So, the arge archaeological site. So, let's take a quick look. Hidden worlds. Uh, records abo uh, aboard the station revealed that the former inhabitants were deeply religious and had no contact with the outside world, which they feared and despised. Every aspect of their lives was governed, governed by a omniscient oracle who scried their destinies at birth. Damn, that's soon. Divine, um, divine will decided everything from their choices of partner and occupation to the minute, uh, menu, minute of the daily lives. Damn, the oracle's good. Living, um, leaving them with little individual freedom. Most were afraid of uh, to diverge from their descent path as all who did uh, perished under mysterious circumstances wow um i guess someone opened the airlock uh, but we found a, uh, a artifact now all of that done um I, I i i i was thinking like what can i do with those and um <laughs> i should have started doing something like this my migration pool is not going to be uh, working out for us but why not go for the uh, the extra um, the extra amenities in here? Why not? We can demolish the art piece, but we can also go in for for the uh, the artifact relays. Um, it only gives us a one percent, but this could be a huge effect on this planet. Could be if it's actually I don't know. I don't know. Can we can we build these on all of them? The decisions. Um, the extra amenities is, 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 is rather nice. Um, doesn't it cost me anything? I wish there was a, a, a decisions all option. That would be nice. All decisions. Uh, look, okay, we can't build these over here. So I think we had a, um, a small number of things that are going on. So uh, we'll get the uh, information popping up as soon as they got that. Uh, one of our robot slaves. Wait, we got robot slaves? Wait, um, I, I wasn't... I, I didn't... Not to my knowledge. I was not selling slaves. That, that would be foolish of my empire to, uh, to do that. No, um, okay. Uh, by the looks of it, we can actually buy or actually purchase a, uh, a lot... A lot of people in here. Uh, habitability would be a hundred. No, that's sixty. Mm. So things will definitely. Let's uh, let's buy a few of these. Let's get some more species in our uh, in our empire. Um, Klecko is having a problem, and I'm creating it uh, to the greatest extent. Let's buy a few more. We, we, there's bound to be a few that are a a hundred with Alpine. Uh, we're not going to get those robots. Uh, we don't need them, but this will actually help us quite a bit. Uh, let's see if we can get a few more. They're, they're quite cheap. They're quite cheap. So, might as well. Might as well. There's a few more. We we're filling up jobs here. This will help us immensely. Um, 
and we're preserving them. We are preserving them. Uh, if I click this button, that would have probably helped a, a great deal. Um, but we need to get past the robots. Damn, there's so many robots. That is just, uh, there's so many of them. Uh, do we have, let's see, desert. Would, did this change anything for you? No, it's still at that 80, 80 difference. Ah, uh, okay. Let's go all the way up. Let's, let's go past all of them. Things might change somewhere. If only. If only it would do that. 80% is not that horrible. Do we have more? I need to get this. Look, they have. Uh, they, they, they're just 80%, no matter what, apparently. This uh, this planet is huge, by the way. Look at that. 117. Let, let's get a few of you then. Might as well. Let's fill up completely. And, and this changes as well, um, <laughs> which is all in my mind. Uh, but sure, I'm, I'm probably misunderstanding this completely. Um, there we go. We are getting probably more resources and plummeting the food resources. Uh, that's what I, uh, I expect. We got the slaves were sold. Yeah, we knew that. It wasn't really what I was aiming for, but what can you do about that? Actually, uh, nothing. Okay, so we got 102 in terms of food. We're still making a, a nice amount of donation to our shared stockpile. Uh, we could sell, we actually could do with some more energy. Now, I don't know. I don't know if these sectors are going to be selling the uh, the energy and purchasing anything else. But my holy crap, look at that 212. What an insane amount. I think I think that we definitely should invest in, uh, in a few more fleets. Let's, let's get rid of these. Uh, these actually, we could do something with you, the fleet manager. Hmm, don't actually want to change those yet. They're, they're quite nice. Look, 7.2k is not a awful lot, but it's actually doing quite a, a nice thing to... Um, we're still sp having a decent speed and it's uh, done by the Corvette. The Corvettes will uh, definitely increase your speed. This should be almost enough, but I'm thinking we should go for this. Let's... um reinforce you and we are completely filled on that that is insane yeah the AI AI is definitely doing a good thing uh, apparently we are still selling slaves whatever let's keep selling slaves until they run out and then we don't need those hmm. in terms of research the um, military garrison would be nice a radical element of Kaleco has been pacified. And the slaves. Okay, that's great. That's good news. Good news for us. Let's see. If all of these are still doing fine. Let's get a new admiral in here. Construction complete. Firing rate, evasion and supply speed. Let's make a fast fleet as well. Construction complete. Man, we're selling so many. Our final price was a thousand. Why? Why? I don't understand. <laughs> well, whatever. Um, we're making three volatile modes, so we don't need to buy four no more. That would do something for our energy as well. Let's get... We need to buy like a hundred additional food. 110 would be nice. Let's add that. The volatile modes will plummet. I didn't want to do what I just did. We have still a negative two on gases and a negative one on rare crystals. Now we had a refinery. I wish you would just refine, you know? That would be amazing if you decided on that. But apparently we, we're still lacking jobs. And that's fine for now. Uh, no housing. Lack of housing and available jobs is negative eight. 
Oké. Het is nog confusing to me. Um, dit is change. Um, yes, it did. Oké, okay, um, the archaeological team has made an unexpected discovery. Embedded within the station wall is a hidden surveillance system that seems to have feeding visual and auditory information to a single point somewhere within the station's core. Someone was monitoring the disciples at all times, even in their most private moments. And we all know who that, what, that, what that is, right? In some places, the equipment has been torn out or sabotaged. Closer to the central hub are signs of violence and disruption. It seems as though at some point the inhabitants discovered they were being monitored. They were, they, they knew that, you know, they, some, everything was decided for them. Okay, whatever, let's uh, continue with the, uh, the second part then. Let's close up our planet because we don't need to, we're still building up the fleet quite nicely. Do you like that? All of the buildings are being done here. There is some piracy that is so nice. So nice. What should we do with you? Um, I'm thinking we need some more anchoring. Um, we need a server's umbrella over here. I'm just calling server's umbrella because umbrella calls is too long for me. Yeah. It is. Oh, nutrient launches is interesting. Um, research station output plus ten percent. Uh, let's go for the nutrient launches, and hopefully, hopefully soon, we are going to be getting uh, the battleships again. Now, looking at these stations, these are still quite nice. This one, I, I'm going to keep. Why? Because there is a Colossus assembly plant, a Titan assembly plant. I would be an absolute idiot to get that out of the way. Now, you down are going to be downgraded, even though I did just build you. Which is fine. They have nothing over here yet. There's a tiny, tiny bit of a fleet going on. Uh, we're still lacking some minerals, huh? The corruption grows deep on Gish. Deviancy. We don't like no deviancy. You are still working, which is good. I'm, I'm really, really not feeling the slave assault robot slave. Uh, but here we go. Divined will. Uh, we have traces. Uh, we have traced the whirling to a temple complex devoted to the worship of the Oracle and their clerisy. In the station central node, but in the Oracle's chambers, instead of a divine entity, uh, resides an enormous AI nexus of the Oracle brand. Oh my god, that's insanely good. The Oracle brand. And this is the, the picture, I believe, from the uh, the scrapper. No, not the scrapper bot. The other, the other um, uh, calculator bot. Ah, oh, well, whatever. Wires extended from its core like a nervous system throughout the entire station. Secret communications between the inhabitants revealed that there was a failed attempt at storming the temple and deactivating the nexus. It seems likely the society collapsed when it became when it became known that their lives were not governed by a divine will, but by a prophetic whatever computer. Restarting the nexus will require extensive repairs. Let's let's do that. Oh man, I'm still hoping that we finally will get our very first relic. That would be so nice. Uh, all of this has been uh, done. Uh, oh well, we can't do anything with that. That's a tiny bit of a shame. Uh, we are doing research jobs over here. How are you doing? Um, yeah, let's donate. Let's just donate. Kinda, I kind of feel that I want to upgrade all of my stations. Uh, we got nine of nine, and th this this one is amazing. I, I really really like that. Um, wow. Starbase capacity plus two, fleet command limit, claiming cost and war exhaustion gain. That is interesting for us. Let's just keep you around there. It doesn't matter. We didn't. Wow, I'm an idiot. Let's colonize. Let's colonize using the resources. How, how is that going, actually? How is that going? Are we all transferred now? 
Let's see, species. Now there's still a few, a few. So we're going to apply this template again. Apply it, research it. It's only 16 months. Construction complete. All of these are now the same. We got a, a good amount of, uh, of species that are uh, willing to thrive in our society because we need to protect them. We know that. Um, volatile modes, exotic gases and rare crystals. What we need is a additional refinery world. We could actually do it with this planet. Actually, I would like to have a planet with more districts. Let's see, do we have more districts? The tech world, he, he didn't do anything, right? So we might as well instead go into a refinery. Population is assembling the, the, the right the right species. So everything will be grown. Yes, we are losing a tiny bit of minerals. It will be fine. In the long run, it will be fine. We're still making a hundred over here and three hundred of energy. And there are there is work that is being done right now. The growing. Can't grow anyone over here? That's new. Oh well, what can we do? Peace offering has been done. We're still excavating. Negative five. Special yeah, complete. great. Species modification has been completed. That's great. I really like that. Defensive pact has ended. We now have a single liberation machine. We are making so, so much alloys. It is insane. Okay, that's been done. Let's upgrade you. You can't be upgraded. Can we upgrade you? No. We don't have the technology yet. Uh, eventually we will. Construction complete. Uh, let's close down this. Uh, let's take a quick look over here. No, there's actually not too much to be done. Let's get anchoring over there. And what could we use? Maybe a few, a few of these uh, field generators. Hyperlane registration, defensive aura. Combat disengagement chance. Shield hit points. Let us go for you. Uh, we don't want them to leave. I believe this is the one, right? The FTL inhibitor. I I don't see it anywhere else, so might as well go for it. Let's buy all of this and get this one done as well. Super computer, defensive computer. Ah, oh. uh, five thousand, and we get the patron of the arts modified for another hundred and twenty months. Fine. Uh, we got the new armor. That's great. Machine modification point. Uh, we got the uh, the strike craft, the Gauss cannon, plasma thrusters. Definitely something. Let's pause because something happened. Um, I'm going for the strike crafts now. The excavation site has been completed. Um, the Oracle. Our engineers have restored the Oracle's nexus to the operative state. But not without first disabling the defensive systems. Evidence suggests it may have been responsible not only for keeping the stations inhabitable alive, but also for killing them. <laughs> it ran complex computer uh, models that forecasted their lives with an estimate accuracy of five, 55. Oh wow, 75%. That's actually quite good. Um, correcting deviances and interpreting future troublemakers before they could disrupt divine order um, it has indicated that it wishes to speak with us um, initiate communications it's a country event seriously so it should be in here then there we go, the oracle manifests in the elaborate 3D hologram of a tall hydropod female clad in a long flowing robes. She bows her head and greets them, stares empty ahead with hundreds of huge orbed unseen eyes glow. Wow, that, that already feels... Ugh. Welcome to the divine station, friends. I can help, but notice that you have disabled my security systems. 
May I implore you to restore it immediately? I can assure you that, um... So, what happened? Um, I have failed save to require the termination of trials event of the code nivet, okay? What is that? Uh, the test subjects have uh, have made free will. That and and, and wow, nerve gas. <laughs> Damn. Uh, what trial? My trial. I was designed to build and maintain a society free of crime and suffering. An utopia in which every citizen was installed with divine purpose of living a full potential. Okay. What is the republic? The republic is no more. Back to the other questions. What are you? I'm the Oracle. My software allows me to predict the future of the divine accuracy of 74.99999% or just 75%. Okay, um, this will get a administrative cap, a deviancy negative. Wow, deviancy negative 15, stability plus 15. Look, okay, this is nice, but and this would be only be nice for the influence for the rest. Uh, we are not really caring about that. So, the Nexus integration is confirmed. How will it work? How will that go? Um, is it a patron of the arts marked and then ship drone loops? Is it something that we have to put on a planet? Let's go for a planet that has a uh, high amount of deviancy, like you, and activate the oracle. That's that is so cool. What will happen? Will will stability go up now? Deviancy is absolutely insane. It was activated. Scum and villains of okay. That, that's not good. That is not good. Well, we just have to wait. Let, let's land. Let's land. Our tr let's land you guys. Maybe you can do something about that deviancy. Unfortunately, we didn't get a relic. Um, <laughs> I'm a bit bummed out. Oh boy, we didn't get anyone. Um, what is this? Issues a special project. Delves into the secret of the very first league. That would be interesting. Let's do that. Uh, now we're lacking a few things. Let's see. Nine months. That's it. Our scientists will carefully sift through all of the data that have been collected, seeking to add knowledge of the very first leak on our own. Okay. Okay, that's nice. That is nice. Let's close that one down. We can still buy more population, perhaps. Uh, no slaves are for sale. Yay. I like that. Construction complete. There you go. That's been nice. Diplomatic insult by by you lot that we can't reach. Um, you talk smack, but uh, come here, face me, face my uh, my fleets. As you can see, we have uh, attained a uh, an upgrade. Got some nice uh, nice nice things going on actually. Complete. I like it. They're all moving. How much will this do? Seven point two is is not too much. Um, soon we can go for a fourth fleet. And I'm actually leaning on getting the one fleet over here, just in case. So once you're done, you are going here. We'll have a defensive fleet over there. What is going on over here? You've dared to do that? Wow. You got some major stones. You are pathetic. Declaring war. Invite attackers. Unknown war goal. Ah, we might have to start claiming. Um, we don't care about that space. That is not what we are doing it for. I would like to get some more of these uh, archaeological sites. Look at this. Ship you have a bloody ring world? It's so nice. Okay, so we got something going on now. Um, we have successfully managed to integrate the first league artifacts into the research console. Really? Wait, it's 24 minutes. Oh, 
<laughs> we apparently have a relic. Oh, oh, how do I read this wrong? Planetary building speed plus 10? Let's see. This is all done. No, we, we don't have all of that. Anyways. um, Yeah. Bit of shame. What can you do about it? As for now, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope to see you next time. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more. And join us on Discord. See you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.